So, today is our 10 year anniversary of our wedding. I guess we've been together like 15. Yeah. Been together for 15 years. She's put up with me. And I put up with her. A lot of stuff. Just kidding. Uh, 10 years ago today, about this time, about 10.50 in the morning, I was playing golf and she was freaking out. <laughs> yes, I was. He was having so much fun and I was trying so hard to get all the wedding stuff finished up and uh, all the details that just were not coming together and pretty sure I had a panic attack and was in tears about this point. And I had borrowed a Corvette from a friend of mine. I was driving around and, well, not a Cor it had a Corvette engine in this car. It was an SSR. And me and all of the groomsmen went to play golf that morning. Uh, I chipped one in on a hole, it was a good day. And then I drove that car around until the rest of the day until it was time for the wedding. And then I showed up for the wedding. And that's the difference between guys yeah. and girls. <laughs> but she wishes she could do it differently now. Oh, absolutely. I would do it. Totally she would have gone and got a massage or something like that. Like I went to play golf. You had a blast. I was crying. Yeah, she was. She was crying a lot. Yeah, not because not she was happy to get married, <laughs> because or because I was sad to get married. She was stressed from the wedding and stuff. Do you remember my eye? Yeah, I do remember. For like that. three or four it months. Just twitch. Oh, I had it twitch for like three or four months before the wedding because I was so stressed. <laughs> That's bad. It was so terrible. Yeah. So. And we are on our way right now. My brother is watching the triplets and her mom is watching Isaiah. And we are going on the first date we've been on in over a year. We have not been to dinner and a movie, which is not dinner, it's, it's lunch, lunch and a movie. It's lunch because, you know, we're tired by dinner time. And we don't have the energy to stay awake and watch a movie. And I haven't stayed awake through a movie in a long time. Even when we, go, when we went to the movies, I would still fall asleep. Like the highest rated action movies of the year. What was that like? I fell asleep through. <laughs> I don't know what that movie was, but um, it was so funny. Yeah. I just can't stand it. But maybe I will today. Yeah, because it's. We're going to go watch a Star Wars. 53 in the morning. And we're watching Star Wars. You look at our life 10 years ago and where we were at and what we were going through at that time, and it is nothing compared to what we're doing now. Now we have four kids, three, uh, we have three three-year-olds and one eight-month-old, or nine-month-old. Oh no, he's eight and a half months. Eight and not a half giving months. him that half a month. Okay. I'm excited to have a meal without kids for the first time in eight months for sure. I mean, mm -hmm. I haven't been on a date in much longer than that, but we haven't had a meal without at least one kid in eight and a half months. Yeah. So we are on our way to the store. We're going to get some socks for Isaiah. This is what we're doing on our anniversary. <laughs> going to Walmart. We're going to return some stuff that has needed to be returned and we haven't had time because none of the kids and we're going to get him some cereal. So. Happy anniversary. And then we're gonna go out to eat and go to a movie. Big day today. Oh yeah. So we just got a text from Justin's mom uh, wishing us happy 10 year anniversary in which she pointed out, you know, how much our lives have changed in the past 10 years. And then she said in 10 more years, we'll have three teenagers. Isn't that awful? That sounds terrible. Yes. Why would she point that out? What? 10, 13 year olds. Oh my gosh. 10, 13 year olds. Oh. Three. Three 13 year olds. I'm not we even. Don't want 10, I, I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Three 13 year olds. But I'm not even worried about the boys being 13. I'm worried about having a 13 year old daughter. That is going to be terrible for a dad. All you dads out there that have teenage daughters, I feel you. Write a book because I need to read it. Okay, we just got to the movie theater and sat down. And it's not going good because my chair is super comfortable, so I'm guessing it's going to be about 30 minutes and I'll be asleep. 
which will be nice. I just hate paying 20 bucks to go to sleep. <laughs> A movie theater with surround sounds quieter than our house. <laughs> But I'm excited to watch this movie. It's gonna be a good one. Here we go, first movie in. Long run. All over a year. So, after driving to three different restaurants, we realized that there aren't a whole lot of places that are open at 11 o'clock on a Thursday afternoon, surprisingly. But I guess everybody's open for dinner. I don't know. We're never out. But we ended up eating at Olive Garden. Then we hit up the Dollar Tree. And I'll show you what we did while we were there. We got a clip. We'll insert it here. Hey, it's our 10 year anniversary. We just finished eating lunch. And somehow we end up talking about buying these for the kids. All I wanted to do was come in and get some cheap candy. Look what Alicia's got. She wants to buy this. It's just a day. Just a day in the life of our family. <laughs> and then we went to see. It was very good. It was really good. I really enjoyed it. I didn't even fall asleep. He was, was like the whole yeah. time, like laughing. It actually had a lot of really funny parts, which I liked. I like Star Wars. I don't remember from one episode to another or keep up with the characters. I'll, I'll see somebody and think, oh, I remember seeing them, or but I don't really remember the storyline. I'm not huge into it, but I really enjoyed the movie. Yeah. What do you think? I really liked it. I thought it was one of the best Star Wars yet. I'm probably... <laughs> we were in the theater sitting there just, it was just like up and down in the seat, just so excited. <laughs> <laughs> he said, he said, this has got to be the best Star Wars yet. <laughs> and then he said, or maybe I just haven't seen a movie in a really long time. <laughs> so we can't really tell you how it holds up to other Star Wars movies because we were just really excited to be out of the house. <laughs> we haven't seen like the last two Star Wars movies. So. Yeah. But, but this was a standalone kind of. And it was really good. So now we are off to Walmart. To buy the kids socks. Oh, we got to get Isaiah socks. Because the poor baby has never, I mean, he's got newborn socks, but he's been in cast so much. Yeah, he, he, socks for he the needs baby. some socks. We'll get so, some we gotta go find him some socks. What do you think about your surprise? What? Uh, what do you see him? Look at that. Y'all are too cool. Mommy, you bought the door? Yeah, I bought that at the store for you. Sister, can I, I turn yours you over the right way? You got him upside down. I'll do it. Okay, do it that one. Mommy, my socks side down, Mom. My socks side down. No, you had it the right way the first time. Daddy? Yes, like that. Oh, Daddy. Welcome. Cooper, you turn yours over the other way. What, that? Yes. That's upside down. Put them up. It's upside down. No, that's the right way. It hooks on your ears and your nose. Isaiah is about to get his first bath in probably about three months since he's had his cast on. Check out his feet. He got him off yesterday, but he fell asleep too soon. Oh. And he didn't get his bath what's yesterday. What's the water, Mama? Look at Mommy, what's the water? He can be all what's cleaned up. Isaiah, what do you think about the water? Oh, 
I'm just telling the pups. I'm telling the pups. Pups, you can go yet. Then you can go first. So they're gonna. I don't do that.